I'm Brandy Taylor, and this is my husband. My name is James Taylor. We've been married for 29 years, a little over 29 years. We met in high school. We like to have fun, and we found out early on that we couldn't have children, so our life became about having fun, especially after we found out the eventuality of our life was going to be dialysis. So we bought campers and had fun and went fishing and went camping and kayaked and hiked and very outdoor people started our farming adventures until the last few years, whenever the sickness took hold. But that's not who we are and that's not our life. That doesn't define who we are, the sickness. We live life still to the fullest despite that. I think you had just turned 25 and uh, he went to his first kidney specialist and they scheduled a kidney biopsy due to his lab work that had been done by the family doctor. So they went and scheduled his biopsy and he came back having um, chronic membranous glomerular nephritis. They found a seven centimeter tumor on his left kidney. So we had already had the discussion with our regular nephrologist what our dialysis plan was because we knew it was going to be coming within the next year. By the time we started discussing me actually getting a surgical fistula again, um, we found out about a product called Wavelink. Um, once we were told that there was a non-surgical option because he was tired, he had been in, the, in and out of the hospital, multiple surgeries for recurrent cancer. Um, he had finished radiation treatments. He was tired of hospitals. He was surgically tired. He was hospital tired. So James came to me back in 2019. Uh, he and his wife Brandy came. They actually were referred by their nephrologist. I think they had heard about the wavelength procedure already as far as an option for them. Going through all the advantages of an endo where cosmetically it's better, where the procedurally it's, it's easier to tolerate. Uh, I think all of those factors kind of played in. So when we told him that, yeah, you know, he is an option for an endo AVF, he, he was all in. He said, let's do it. I think one of the most important messages that we like to get across is be sure that you have a doctor that lays out all the options for you. That way, so you can make an informed decision about your health care and your treatment. With the Wavelink, it was done as a procedure in my doctor's office. I'm two years in, and as you can see, I do not have any raised part of my arm where my fistula is or my buttonholes. Just for appearances, to not have that nodding on your arm and and people go, oh, what's wrong with him? Why is his arm deformed like that? Or, or stuff like that, you don't have to answer those questions. Basically, when we're not doing dialysis, we don't think about it. Exactly. We live our life. 